Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is your speaking and welcome to the play by email 1 turn 37 uh, I need to be a little bit tiny more quiet, everybody is sleeping at the moment at home <laughs> so I can't raise my voice too much, I hope the volume will be actually okay now what do we have in here my yeah, my capital have grown one pop great if you didn't know this is how the production mm, trick work when you're on production focus with the extra growth of population your tile i mean like your extra citizen goes to the best production tiles so you actually get the surplus of one hammer this way or perhaps even more if you would set the food focus uh, so that's just a little bit think about the micromanagement I mean like in the course of a 200 game though this is always like a 200 hammers advantage more if you work on the mine and even more if you count into the um, extra bonus from chemistry or even greater tiles like aluminium of coal there's like plenty of videos i think about it i probably will do s at some point one of uh, my own but okay let's check this from um, the hill to the horse now how many turns do i have why this is not a ah, calendar one turn and five turns on a pasture well there's still 11 turns to grow and probably with the caravan I will still have the time to grow this city to population to maybe wait a little bit because I really want to get a caravan here and a water mill I would yeah I would really love to get a caravan and a water mill before getting more um, settlers now what's happening here I really hope this ancient ruin is still here yes alright so cross my fingers in English but in Polish we say trzymaj uh, so I'm holding my thumbs mm, yeah get my fingers crossed and what do we get fate <laughs> not bad I guess this is not bad not bad and this is coast so it seems like I'm really in an absolutely edge of the map so this side is absolutely to myself now did German scout leave that Asian ruin? Well, I guess we're going to know that in the next turn. Okay, I just want to check Germany's... Yeah, two pop. Two pop and here. Military-wise, he's definitely killing me right now. But thankfully, I got a nice crop yield. Number one crop yield, that's nice. Theoretically, second in science, which means zero, <laughs> and second in hammers. But somebody look at this 10 hammers ahead. This is that probably Pacatello, old prince playing Shoshone, and he's got King Solomon mine in his capital. I know that already, right? I know that already. So, this is going to be too hard to catch up. Um, okay, I guess this is all about this turn. Now, I would really love to talk a bit. I'm like, it's um it's thursday already and i haven't started editing uh videos for the weekend yet i just didn't have the time and possibility to do it uh quite a busy time lately now the question is what would you like to see first now i got a free for all game recorded from this week uh, I don't want to spoil too much my point is I overestimated my uh, I overestimated my strength basically it was a very long game uh, so it was all night and I was pretty much tired from work throughout all the week my shadow was absolutely messed up I was working like uh, somewhere between second and third shift so uh, somewhere in the course of that game I'm like pretty tired and my mind like, like hmm, okay uh, what's up what's going on so the quality of my commentary on that game is not that great the game itself is not that bad I mean, like it's quite a cool game at least in in my standards so 
the question is do you want me to upload that because well if not that first I have a mm, couple of cool teamers recorded especially I have a very cool teamer 2v2 play with Merle you probably heard about Merle a lot of my channel in my opinion that's the number one guy when it comes to duels and teamers uh, at least the ancient classical probably until industrial modern era he's the guy you want to learn from uh, so I caught one cool teamer on this weekend playing with Merle in my team uh, so basically you can learn a lot about fighting from that game so I could edit and upload that one first uh, or or another option is a 3v3 I have almost ready up uh, also all, or some tournament duels I'm actually participating in a dual tournament uh, organized by Sifanatics dot ru and not doing that great I mean like I when I got out from the group phase mm, now uh, the second part of the tournament is it's double elimination which actually I didn't understand what that meant I I thought it was to two wins basically so uh, the first match I absolutely dropped to the loser bracket because I thought we were going to play two to two wins and my first game against Salamandra, I believe. Uh, I went too cocky basically because I was like, oh, okay, I can test out that player um, in a duel and I can still play the rematch since this is the two wins so I can learn about his uh, basically skills and tactics. I haven't played too much with Russian players at all. They have a very different and unique play style in my opinion from what I used to playing with US and um, European players so it's something new for me uh, and I can start uploading some of those games as well so if you could give me a little bit of feedback on like as I said it's uh, Thursday already and I'd definitely like to uh, give me a second There we go. Everybody's sleeping at home, and of course, Cat wants to make some noise. Uh, so, as I said, I cannot prepare too many games for the weekend, and later on, I will still not be able to upload next week. Uh, so, I would like to give a little bit of feedback what actually you would like to see. So, the choice is between a free for all with a little bit of sleepy commentary from me, uh, Teamers 2v2. Or 3v3 or I probably 2v2 and 3v3 I could prepare those are a little bit shorter games than the free for all and there is a chance of couple of duels I have for example a duel that is ready to upload um, ready to upload it's not ready I still need to edit it but I have um, played a lot of all-out peaceful games versus Tommy and T uh, in the course of last two months so those are pretty old games uh, but still in my opinion pretty good mm, learning stuff about the timings so those are all out peaceful games played on mirror maps uh, uh, only you know like science culture victory stuff like that no war at all uh, so you can basically see a lot of cool timings uh, from those duels and it's against Tommy and you which is the I guess I think is like number one player about the single player part I mean like if you want to learn how to abuse AI and get great results and finishing times in single player definitely Tommy and T is the guy you want to learn from so, all right so a lot of choices right so give me at least a little bit of feedback what would you like to see uh, first so I can actually know what should I prioritize on since my time is very limited lately and uh, it's been hard for me to you know like prepare the stuff to edit on my pc right now all right so that's it for this turn oh still about this turn uh we could start i'm gonna make from for next turn or maybe in two turns i'm gonna link you the um, 
the thread on the forum. I know it's in Polish, but I'm gonna link you the thread on the forum to this game so you can actually read the chronicle. There's gonna be a chronicle for this game, so you can definitely uh, work together uh, on a post in the chronicle and especially to start the really diplomatic relationships with Germany. All right, so that's all. That's it for this turn and for this short video. So thank you very much for watching and see you next time. Best wishes, yourself.